Jeff Bezos appears at Texas launch site with his Blue Origin crew, including brother Mark, Wally Funk, and lucky Dutch teen whose dad paid for flight. New Shepard rocket will blast them 66 miles above Earth tomorrow 13 miles higher than Branson. Welcome to the Dumb Dumb News channel, dedicated to reviewing news stories from around the world. Help me trigger the YouTube algorithm by pressing the thumbs up button, subscribing to my channel, leaving a comment, and sharing with someone you think would like this content. Sources will be linked in the description, so you can read the full details yourself. The article further states, Jeff Bezos appeared in several interviews on Monday with his brother Mark and two other Blue Origin teammates Wally Funk and teenager Oliver Damon from the base at Van Horn, Texas. All right. Feels good to be in the flight suit. Oh boy, you guys look great. Welcome astronauts to Launch Site 1 and welcome to the Astronaut Training Center. This capsule is the RTS Tortoise. It is a full-scale mock-up. How are you guys feeling? I have oh, good. good. I literally have had goosebumps since I started. <laughs> like they haven't gone away. They will blast off from launch site one aboard the new Shepard rocket on Tuesday, July 20th at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time to 2 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time. They insist they are ready for the mission and that it will set a precedent for commercial space travel. The passengers will spend four minutes floating in zero gravity in space before a return back to Earth. Wally Funk, 82, will become the oldest person to go to space. She was one of the 13 women who passed NASA's astronaut training program in the 1960s. Oliver Damon is an 18-year-old physics student from the Netherlands whose father paid for his flight. He only got the coveted seat because another man who paid $28 million for it dropped out. Virgin Galactic founder Sir Richard Branson became the first billionaire founder astronaut of the space set. In my opinion, you can do whatever you want with your money. In this case these billionaires want to go down in history as the first ones to start doing commercial flights into space. Known as the final frontier, space has always been the off-limits place for humans, and that is why they are spending their money doing this. In the 80s one of NASA's space ships exploded shortly after launching, while being broadcasted on live TV. I don't wish that on them, but I do think that money can be better spent on other more pressing issues. I do think they have foundations set up to give back to the community, but I still wonder if this is a good way to spend resources. I saw this meme recently, that gives us a good idea of what is happening with these guys. Well, I hope you have a great week, and I appreciate all the viewers and wide range of comments. Those are my thoughts, what are yours? Leave them in the comments below, please share this video for education and awareness, for the Dumb Dumb News channel, I'm Dumb Dumb.